I think we are living in the most exciting time to be a biophysicist and do biophysics. This is because with the technical advancements, both from an experimental and computational standpoint, we are now able to ask questions that were intractable even a decade ago. As science becomes increasingly interdisciplinary, the Biophysical Society annual meeting continues its long-held reputation for bringing together leading scientists from all over the world who work at the interface of the life, physical, and computational sciences. From the phenomenal city of Philadelphia, this is the Biophysical Society's annual meeting and you're watching Biophysical Society TV. With new techniques and, and where we see the technologies that physics brings to biology going, there's a new generation of biophysicists coming down the pipeline that are applying physics to biology in a completely new way. So you can have topics that go from intrinsically disordered uh, regions, but in transcription, all the way to climate change, cancer biophysics. Plant biophysics. Plant biophysics, yes. When I first started in physics, the concept that even physicists could make such inroads into cancer biology was limited to diagnostic techniques or imaging. But now this appreciation that biophysics itself can influence cancer progression and disease response in terms of therapeutics and so forth, it opens up a wider range of biophysicists in terms of what we bring to the table. Biophysicists have a multiverse of career opportunities available to them. So many times biophysicists think that the entire extent of their value is tied to their science and their technology expertise. But you also have so many business skills, you have professional skills, you have communications and project management skills. So start with what it is that you love to do. And the second component would be to engage in thoughtful strategic networking. This is my first time being here and, and I'm enjoying it so far. Um, I got a lot of great discussions with professors, students, and also like the career center here. So it was really helpful. First, I was coming as a postdoctoral researcher and PhD student, and now I'm bringing my own students. So uh, wonderful transition, yes. Everything I know about biophysics, I learned through the society. And uh, for the young uh, researchers and scientists, my uh, suggestion would be to uh, seek out opportunities to meet uh, new people because your career and life will be shaped by the people you meet and by uh, volunteering to serve under society uh, duties, you increase your uh, networking opportunities. I really enjoyed um, all the posters so far and seeing all the different types of research offered. It's just really inspiring to be surrounded by so many other people who are also interested in the same things that we are. This is a thriving society and it's going to be my job to look at new threats and opportunities and always try to serve our members better. I've always had good experiences coming here to, to BPS and I'm excited that they're creating space to lift black voices and folks in the society are always willing to, to look at your work and, and to give you guidance. I just want to see what it's like to meet a lot of people, to connect with a lot of people, and also I got the opportunity to present my research. So the real question is, how couldn't I be here? <laughs> <laughs>